do you consent to me giving you a kiss? Anywhere I like. Yeah, of course. Or I gotta breathe in your ear for five seconds. Whatever's, whatever's good with you. Hey, my name is Fatima. I'm from Boston, Massachusetts, Roxbury to be exact. I'm a Sagittarius. Okay, okay. And Fatima, what do you look for in a man usually? What do I look for in a man? I look for security, safety, loyalty, and that's pretty much it. My red flags would have to be like dirty nails or like anything that's just dirty, doesn't smell good, like bad hygiene. That's pretty much it. And how you feeling right now? Are you excited, nervous? I'm I'm chilling. You chilling now? I'm excited though. I'm excited. Cool, cool. I, I want to see what this man's looking like. Yeah. You better not be nervous. You better be ready. Mm -hmm. All right, so I want you to rate the date without being on it yet. So, like, I want you to manifest a number, all right, out of 10. Mm. What do you think it's going to be like? A 8, because I'm never eight. really satisfied. Okay, okay. Well, it's going to be, like, a 8, hopefully. Okay. You already know it's Kim Frank. You feel me? The sexiest fat nigga alive. You feel me? I'm from Brockton mm -hmm. and Wareham. I'm 30, mm -hmm. and I'm a Capricorn. Okay, okay, okay. All right, and Frank. What do you usually look for in a woman? Um, consistency. Mm, okay. And loyalty. Consistency and loyalty. Tell me. All right. So what's your red flags? Red flags? Like trendy, just too followy, like trying to follow too many things. Yeah. You feel know I me? Mean? Like just trying to be like everybody. Yeah, not your own person. <clears throat> okay. Red flag. Frank, how you feeling right now? Are you excited, nervous? How you feeling? Cooling. I got the butterflies. You got the butterflies? <clears throat> I'm a little nervous. I feel like I'm in high school right now. You oh, feel yeah. Me? I don't know what to expect. Well, mm -hmm. I want you to rate the date without being on it yet. So, like, I want you to, to manifest a number. What do you think this date's gonna be like out of 10? Well, with the fireplace behind me, I'm gonna have to go like, I'm gonna just, to be safe, I'm gonna go like 7.5. 7.5? 7 oh, yeah. that's not bad. Just to that's be not safe, bad. you feel me? Okay, like, let's go see your date. Right, welcome. This is Fully Loaded Sugar Split. Thank y'all for joining us. What's poppin'? What's good, what's good? Over here we have Frank. Frank, say what's up. What's happening is Frank. All right. I can't now, see. Fatima, say hi. Hi. Now, Frank, I want you to rate Fatima's voice out of 10 with your fingers. Can I, I need to hear her say her. Can she say one more thing? Yeah, say one more thing. What you want me to say? Um, you can say your name again. Fatima. I'll give, you said one to hey, 10? Hey, nah, nah, with your fingers. Oh, you, you said one to, you said one, one to 10, 10 though, right? 10, yeah. All right, I'll give it like. Okay, okay, okay. I have a team of over there. She don't even know. I have a team of rate Frank's voice out of 10. What's your thing? Okay, all right, all right. Y'all can take out blindfolds off. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, thank y'all for joining us. This is Bully Lotus Stricker Split. We have wine here. I know. Oh, you got the wine? Yeah, we got, um, we got a couple of wine. Nice Hi. to meet you. Nice to meet you. For sure. Yeah, how y'all feeling? Y'all excited? Yeah, yeah now the blindfold is off, I'm good. Rules are simple. Pick up fully loaded card. Ask your date the question on the card. For every question skip, the person answering must take a shot. For every additional question missed, the person answering must take consecutive shots. If someone hesitates to answer or get into detail, they must take a shot. Name a non-negotiable requirement your girl must possess before dating you. A non Something she must have before dating you. A job. She must have a job. Yeah. All right. Like even if she already got bread. And yeah, she, she gotta have a job for sure. But if she got a job, I know she's motivated. You get what I'm saying? Like I know at least she wants to get bread. Name three mandatory requirements a man must have before dating you. Oh, so. So we got the same. Three mandatory though. Oh, um, the three, yeah. He must have all his marbles. Like, he must be saying, I don't want no crazy. I don't I respect that. Shit, I don't know. Like, I really don't go after what people have, mm -hmm. like, what they must have. So that's a trick question. What would you like, like though, for them to have? A car. Yeah. Like, you gotta have a car. Mm -hmm. Why do you need to do that drives a car? Why can't you just Uber? I like to be passenger princess. What do you mean, Uber? I might as well date the Uber driver. <laughs> Common sense. And Different. you have to have. Um, money. <laughs> right, how did we forget money? How did we forget money? So you ever dated a broke dude? I have. How was that? I was young, I didn't know he was broke until he cheated on me for a bitch who bought him some food. Would you prefer a woman who cooks but never cleans or a woman who cleans but never cooks? Clean. Cleans but never cooks? She gotta, I can't have no dirt, like, 
I can figure out the food I can cook, so I don't, but she can't be dirty. <laughs> you feel me? Like, that's crazy. So the if she doesn't dirty, clean that dirty, I don't even want yeah. her to cook if, right. if, the, if the crib's dirty. You gotta be on top of your A game. I wanna walk in your crib, it's clean, there's not Capri Suns and juices and shit. Like, nah, that's nasty, you feel me? Yeah. <laughs> well, what if she does the cooking and you do the cleaning? No, you would rather her do the cleaning and she do the cooking? Yeah. As a woman, you should wanna be clean, smell good. Your house should be clean. Men, I feel like men are automatically like, they're kind of like a little on the shabby side. So as a woman, you gotta do some cleaning. How often should your partner call you throughout the day? I don't really have a set number, but you mm. have to, I have to hear from you morning, we wake up, and I have to hear from you before you go to sleep. That's it. So like breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Not, <laughs> that's nice. But I just gotta make sure you woke up this morning yeah. and I gotta make sure, the day, was, you know yeah, what I'm I saying? Smooth. You able to go to sleep at night. Like, what if they sure. miss one of them calls? I don't like that. Cause why are you not calling at night? Where are you at? You get That's a red flag. You, you disappear. At, yeah, exactly, okay. exactly. You're not calling me or you're not answering your phone and it's a problem. It ain't gonna last long. And if you don't hit me up in the morning because you who'd you wake up? Yeah. 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 <laughs> He's with his family. Who you having breakfast with? I'm like, calling your mom. I get it. <laughs> like, I get it. So do you think it's clingy for a girl to want you to call through throughout the whole day? If it's wifey, she she got that. That's wifey. When the bat signal hits the, you know what time it is. You feel me? What's something you do that you wouldn't be comfortable with your partner doing? Ooh, I like that. Smoking a lot of weed for her. So like your partner can't smoke. No, my partner can smoke, but I just don't like a shorty who just smokes a lot of weed. I can fuck with a girl that smokes heavy, just not as much as me. If you're smoking more than me, you're treacherous. You can be the homie, but you can't be my shorty. That's very, you smoke a lot of weed? I smoke a good amount of weed. That's very hypocritical. It's it is, good. it is. I'm not saying it's right, but like, that's just, that's just one of my things. I smoke every single day. Okay, uh, so. You could date another smoker. I can date another smoker. I think that's so weird, cause it's like, you would want somebody to that smoke so they can roll your blunt. He's whack, it's okay. <laughs> cause I smoke down. Um, posting, I don't want, don't be seen, point blank period. Mm. I can post all I want, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> the beagles. <laughs> Why is it like that cause though? Cause I don't want nobody to see you. I don't want nobody scrolling down a timeline and seeing my man. Oh, he looks cute. Double tap. No, like you could be seen on my. So you're shit, like on like, a vacation with the emoji over the face vibes, like. No, I'll post you, okay. but you but can't. You, po don't be posting no pictures. Don't. Nope. Just stay. Why are you trying to be seen? Exactly. Instagram, no pictures. No pictures. Like, no likes. No nothing. Like, just don't be seen at all. Would you <clears> be okay with your significant other taking a girl slash boys trip? Yeah. Yeah. Of course, of course. What? You sure? Of course, of course. Okay. She's a, like adult. You have friends. You can do that. Like you know what I mean? Like, I mean, they can say that and they be nah, popping I'm up. Really like that. I'm really like that. <laughs> and they be popping up. I feel up. like that's kind of like ins like not. I don't know. That's weird. It if is you don't weird, want your but, like yeah. other half to go enjoy themselves with their friends, that's kind of weird. We're born to explore. We're supposed to travel and have fun with our loved ones. If if that makes you insecure, you're not one with yourself. I used to allow my ex. To mm -hmm. go on all types of trips he wanted it. And how did that end? Because I feel like. I mean, you know what they say when you say, don't bring beach to the sand? Mm -hmm. like, why would I bring bitches to Miami, Miami when there's bitches in Miami? Like, so your ex was starting in Miami? Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. Your guy can't go to Miami. Like, there's gonna be interrogations. There's just certain places that I he can't gotta go. give a fuck. Go to Miami. Because I might just pop up too. You wouldn't even know it. In Colombia, I know what y'all be doing in Colombia. I ain't slick. I've never been to Colombia, so I don't even know what's going on. Yeah, they know. <laughs> you me? I ain't been there. Okay. Nah, he could go on his guys' trips, and I can go on my girls' trips. But um, we're gonna be—it's gonna be some interrogation when you get back. If I can't get it up during sex, what you doing to help? Sucking it. <laughs> hey, like, I mean, that's because okay. it's like you only have five seconds to think. What else are you gonna yeah, do? Yeah, no, nah, that's you that's, sit there too long. It's awkward. No more sex. We're not that's what it's. No a, yeah, that's beautiful. Mm -hmm. That means she's not selfish. So I like that. List three simple things that turn you on. Three small things. Definitely like like perfume, like certain, like a good like a certain smell. Oh, sorry. Um, you could like style. You feel me? Like music, clothes, art like all type of style and respect for like family. Like if you like 
like respect. That turns you on. Yeah, I like that type of shit. <laughs> That's some like we can get na like you mean nasty or just like my a girl like my girl like what you like that question. That's yeah. what I did. That's the type. Like of me, like I just like like the it's way nasty, a nigga drives. Shit, nasty like, shit you know too. what I'm saying? Shit like that. Like the way a nigga drives. Like I like that. Like if he drives, cute. <laughs> then it turns me on. Like well, I like the way he drives. You like when a guy drives cute. Like, how does that look like? How does a guy drive? Cute? <laughs> like, like they lean a little bit and they're like, okay. they look over. You know. What I'm like, Could you be with a partner who doesn't give head? I did it before. Um, how? I did it before, but we wasn't all in. Like, it's never gonna be any elevation from that first stage. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? We could mess around, but it's not gonna go nowhere. Cause, no, I'm gonna cheat on you. You have to be a munch. All I deal with is munch. Men gotta understand, like, we need ours too. You know what mm. I'm saying? How else? That's how it's supposed to be, though. Like, it's not supposed to be a like tit for tat. You just do it when, when it's. Yeah. You know what I mean? When it's, it's not. To be of done. course, it's not supposed to be tit for tat, cause you just give head for no reason. But, That's what like, I mean. That's what I'm saying. A man that doesn't give head, you don't love me. Like, you hate me. Are you okay with giving head when necessary? Yeah, of course. That's like, you know, a man should be, we should be willing to do whatever we need to do for our woman when it's time. You know? Do you consent to me giving you a kiss? Anywhere I like. Yeah, of course. Or I got to breathe in your ear for five seconds. Whatever's, whatever's good with you. Hey! hey. Whatever's good hey. with you, Fatima. Yeah, like, what was that like? <laughs> that was beautiful. How was that experience? Um, it was different. I never did that before. Like, I didn't know men like breath. Would you rather be flown out or blown out? Meaning, would you rather a man with money or good dick? I gotta choose. Like, I can't have both. No, you can't have both, Shit. I guess. Yeah, Flown nah, out or blown choose. out. <clears throat> I like that. Mm. Flown out or blown out. Damn. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> like fuck. Um, I'm gonna have to go with blown out. All right. <laughs> fuck okay, it. Okay. So you'd rather a man with good dick, even if he's broke? Um, did I say that? And it was mm. a second part to the question that I think I missed. Now you got would you rather a man with money? Or you feel me? Oh, so when you bring like you to pound that. town. Where you wanna no, no, go? No, no. You wanna go to Barbados? But when you put so you it like that, that's different. Um yeah, pound town still. Can I, can I, can I change my answer? Cause I mean, this now, is what you now when you say it to me, it sounds crazy. I'd rather get dick than money. Nah, I wouldn't. Okay. I take it back. You take it back? Yeah. Show your last received text or the last picture in your camera roll. I really don't care. Which one you want to see? It's up to you. My last photo. It's a video. Let me see. That's my last video, that's my last photo. Let me see the video. Okay. Okay, then, bodega. Gotta show the camera too. Call an ex and ask what's your most toxic trait. Um, oh, you still got the ex's number all there. FaceTime? If this ex don't answer me, I gotta call a different ex. Hey, can you answer this question for me? What is my most toxic trait? Okay. I'm a Sagittarius. I wear my heart on my sleeve. Would you would you agree with that? When I, I act crazy when I love, when hard. love hard. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's crazy though? Like, is it like smashing windows? Is it like calling a lot? Is it like what's, you feel me? Yeah. Both? Both of those? No, I'm not gonna lie, we're not gonna sit here and do this like I'm the crazy one, oh, like, nah, but... like, I don't smash windows. Like, I'll smash windows back. Nah, she break windows. She break windows? She was saying she don't break windows, she break windows. <laughs> and, like, like, somebody fuck with you, like, play with you, you get on that. I get crazy. I don't want to say on camera how crazy I get, I get crazy. That's all and I got to know. we ain't <laughs> windows. If it can't that. go on camera, that, that just <laughs> we Wait, do you smash cars? I, did I ever smash a car? I don't think I ever smashed a window a day in my life. You I promise think? you. I don't think. Thank y'all for being here. Thank y'all for being Y'all can cheers off, cheers off, cheers off. Y'all don't have to drink it, just cheers off, cheers off, cheers off.
Cheers. Cheers. You know. Hey. All right, Fatima, how you feeling? I'm feeling beautiful, blessed to be here. You feel me? I'm feeling good. Feeling good? Yeah. Okay, okay. How was the date? You think it was cool? I think it was pretty cool. I fuck with the date. You feel me? Not somebody that I would really date. Probably somebody I could kick it with, smoke with, eat with. We agreed on a lot, so I, I, I fuck with it. I feel like he's too much of, like, the bro. So, but he's cool, though. He's like, cool, don't right? get me wrong. He's cool. He's handsome. So, okay. So... You rated her voice a seven out of 10, right? Mm -hmm. You rated his voice a seven out of 10, right? Uh-huh. So now that you spoke to her, you got to feel her out and everything, what would you rate the whole date? A six. I'll give it like a 10. Say Frank wanted to go on another date, would you be open to that? He's actually cool. Like, yeah, so you would like, show what? Like, yeah, homie like, type, like, or? Let's just say if it, if it wasn't that, I'd still be cool with No. Would you be willing to pay for the whole date, or would you? And say nah, we need to split. Even if he's like flying you out, like somewhere nice, like Italy or something. The Italy? It. If I'm bringing any women out, I'm paying for the date. We but go 50-50. We could do the 50-50. Uh, but you would take it there, though. You would take. Oh, it I'll home. take it there. But you wouldn't be buddy. open to being on like a romantic type vibe. Sorry, Frank. Nah. Okay. All right. Sorry, Frank. All right.